The Washington International Horse Show, one of the world's leading horse riding competitions, temporarily left our area due to COVID restrictions, but next year it'll be back. And instead of coming to D.C., the event will be held in Prince George's County. Bureau Chief Tracy Wilkins explains what this means for the horse industry, the county, and for Maryland. You look around Prince George's County and it's clear this is a horse town. From its stables and young riders to its champions and the Showplace Arena and Equestrian Center in the county seat. But there's a big rural aspect of this county. Wineries are popping up. Um, uh, other agricultural tourism events throughout the county. So when the Washington International Horse Show considered where its competition should be next year. Washington actually reached out to us because they were leaving D.C. and they were looking for a new home. Sheila Curry, former County First Lady, works in strategic partnerships for Prince George's and is familiar with equestrian competitions. Her adult son began riding at three years old, so she jumped at this opportunity. It's an honor for us to host such a prestigious uh, equestrian event. Washington International is revered. It brings exposure worldwide. There'll be riders here from all over the world, Olympic riders, hopefully Jessica Springsteen, Bruce Springsteen's daughter, she won the silver medal at the Olympics this year uh, in uh, show jumping. Hopefully she will be here competing. And then there's the economic boom that comes with a week of lodging and feeding participants and spectators from around the world. With horse shows come lots of people like the groomers, the farriers, the folks that braid the horse's mane. So all of those folks will fill up the hotels up and down 301, all of the restaurants, Bowie, Largo. So it's a huge economic now, impact for, ever, for the entire Prince George's County. Due to COVID restrictions, Prince George's County has lost a few of its horse shows to other states. But with this news, some are already planning a return. All horse shows want to be where the best is, and Washington is the best. When this competition happens, there are going to be 600 horses here for the event. When this was held in D.C., the city grossed some $11 million in the six days of the competition. Prince George's County is looking forward to how this is going to impact this county. I'm Tracy Wilkins, News 4. The horse show, by the way, will happen October 25th through the 30th, and there are some upgrades planned for Showplace Arena. Between now and then, Governor Hogan has named October Horse Month in honor of the event.